Hey everybody, welcome to my first playthrough of Resident Evil Code Veronica. I've never ever played this game before. I'm using a PS3 emulator. So let's get on it. Identification number is WKD4496. Welcome to your new home. Her name is Claire Redfield. We caught her trespassing in our Paris lab facility 10 days ago. She apparently infiltrated the complex looking for her lost brother, Chris Redfield, one of the surviving members of RPD's famous STARS teams. And that dude's voice sounds like Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Perfect. 
Go on. Get out of here. This place is finished. I don't know. It might have been a special forces team. But in any case, this prison's been taken over. Troops have been wiped out. What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. But you may as well know, you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. Action-packed intro there. So I've never played this game, not even as a kid. I, was, I played Resident Evil 2 a lot, but I got very... Well, I should say my dad played Resident Evil 2 a lot, and I just watched him because I was too scared to play. But lately I've been getting really into playing Resident Evil games. Making my way downtown, spaces pass. She never burns her hand on that light, so she just keeps it a lot the whole time. So take the briefcase. Should I look at? Stab them to death. Shoot. Who are I, I don't shoot. 
Huh? You're not a zombie. Well, great. Wait right there. I'm coming over. Shoot first, ask questions later. Uh, sorry about that little misunderstanding. But I thought you were another one of those monsters. Shut up. Make one wrong move and I'll shoot. Relax, beautiful. I said I was sorry. My name's Steve. I was a prisoner on this island. And I'm guessing you're not from Umbrella either. No, I'm Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire? Hmm. Nice. I'll remember that. Hey, I heard there's an airport around here. Once I find it, I can finally escape from this crazy island. Well, I'll see ya. Hey, wait up! I don't want you following me, lady. You'll only slow me down. Because I sound like a little boy, that dude's voice is so weird. You'll only slow me down. Because I'm too ma masculine to be seen with a woman. I've got to do those transitions with the doors. Shoot this guy laughing. Don't want to waste bullets. underneath the building. Still twitching, that guy looks like he's breathing still. He's making a noise. Smacking him. Actually, never went into this building back here. Let me go back. Silly. Hey, look at these guys. Run away, run away. Dogs even get up here. <laughs> it doesn't look like it. So did that dog drag that person? Oh jeez. Come at me, bro. Come at me. I've been playing a lot of the newer Resident Evil, 5, uh, Resident Evil 4 and Resident Evil 5. 
and the gameplay changed so much from these old school style games. I grew up with Resident Evil 2, but I was so scared to play that game. I don't know why, because looking back now, it's so funny. Give me the map. Maybe my one friend finished Resident Evil 2, two and a half hours, one save. I'll never forget that. While well, he finished it, I just watched him play it. I was the brains. He was the not scared to play. So what else is in here? Just a squeaky lot. Yeah, I've got the map. I have some herbs. I'm out of bullets, so let me just... Always make sure you load it with bullets. Could you even watch TV up there? There. I don't know, I'm gonna deal with these dogs. I'm just gonna run away from them. Chicken! Pop, pop, pop. Guys, did you miss me? I'm back. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. As a bad no. on the facility access application. Be sure to verify the contents of the following facility access application form and add the applicant's name to the expected visitors list. Chief Prison Guard Room, Paul Stainer. I hereby apply for access permission for prison area D. Details follow. Visitor's name, Cole Grisham. Purpose of entry, carrying in the following materials. 1. New product sample from Metal Industries Company, TG01. Various daily commodities ordered by the prison. Note, we'll use a transportation truck. TG01 sample will be stored in a designated briefcase. So I guess that was the briefcase that was in that truck earlier. These guys. Chris Redfield. Yes, that's my brother. What are you doing here? Chris Redfield. Is he a relative of yours or something? You mean my brother? Ah. Your siblings. Well, it seems your brother is under surveillance by Umbrella. What? I've got to contact Leon and tell him to let my brother know he's being monitored. It's a good thing I have access to an outside connection from here. 
Well, that file shows the latitude and longitude of this place. <laughs> Why don't you send your brother the coordinates and ask him to come help? Thanks. I'll do that. Hey, I was just kidding. There's no way he could get here, even if he is your brother. Yes, he can. I'm sure of it. No way. He won't come. Ça va, tu les locks. You'll just end up disappointed if you rely on others. Believe me, I know. Tu t'as vu Big Baby? What was that all about? It's got a bad image issues. This is the email to Leon has been sent. I thought it was Chris. Is that in clear? Pick it up. Just release all the zombies. Just put your hand through it. They don't have enough anymore. Then I, I thought the other guy went through that door. Did he? So I kind of played this game a little bit, so I know the beginning parts. I was just testing it out to see if it worked. Users manual. 3D duplicator users manual. A new product, the 3D duplicator consists of two parts. 3D scanner portion. This portion scans a 3D object. Simply place the material that you want to have scanned onto the tray of the scanner. The scanned object will be processed into the 3D data, which will be transferred to the duplicator portion. The duplicator portion. If you place the material you wish to have converted on the machine, you can begin conversion based on the 3D data that was created by the 3D scanner portion. Conversion will be executed with complete data accuracy. The result will be an object precisely true to the original. So just go put some bullets there and duplicate them over and over and over. Infinite ammo. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. And I have to put my ink ribbon here. Wait, but if I do that, then how do I get it back out? Will be on this side? Or... Why don't I just go through? everything in here please deposit any metallic items you have in the uh, security box I don't think it comes up on the other side so how do I come back and get it I guess through the other door I remember increment and thinks is metal apparently well maybe it has metal components inside of it Thank you. 
sorry, I was just trying to get used to the buttons there. I don't know. Push the cool off Bob Tom. Again. You got 15 bullets, make them count. Inside the prison, what is this strange contraption? Nothing. the door up there hmm. let's go in this room here and see what is this key for Padlock, left right outside. I can outrun you, dog. My two legs are better than your four legs. Pedo. I got in the door in the store earlier, what's wrong with me? Prisoner's Diary May 13th. This room stinks of death. Based upon the information I found, I believe that I'm far south of the equator. Lucky for me that Bob in the bunk below me is one of those interesting types of guys. Today Bob told some crazy story of why he was put why he was put this place with me. 
Uh, that was me. Today, Bob was told some crazy story of why he was put in this place with me. Bob said that he used to be an attendant of the head of this place. This boss named Alfred supposedly placed him in here because of a tiny little mistake. What does that mean? What's going to happen to me? Without warning, a group of military men took Bob to the building behind the guillotine stand. At midnight, I'll sneak out of here to see him. I've been hearing that anyone taken to that building never comes back. On top of that, there are these really large plastic bags constantly being removed from their place. I'd better pray for Bob. Man. I was wrong. I shouldn't have gone there. What is going on in there? All I could hear was some insanely creepy laughter and the sound of Bob screaming. I don't know what to do. I can't stop thinking about it. Is that going to happen to me? I can't let it. I just can't. May 27th. <laughs> That's my birthday. Since my last entry, all of my fellow inmates have been taken to that building. I know that I am next. It's obvious that we were all here to be used as Alfred's guinea pigs. There's no way out. What am I going to do? What are you going to do? Nothing. We turn into a zombie. Bullets. That I'm just going to use up. I'm going to kill these guys with my knife. Come at me. Oh man. Twitch, it's freaky. I just knocked them to death. So I've been using playing Resident Evil 5 and then that uses triangle to get into the inventory. So now I keep pushing triangle, it takes me to the map. Oh, these two handguns. They look so strange. <laughs> Tomb Raider. Now I could use another health. I was just idiot, there was no zombies where it didn't come from. That's one thing I never understood about this game, zombies just come from all over the show. Out of nowhere. I think that's everything there. I'm still not even sure how I'm supposed to get that other stuff, but we'll figure it out. We shall figure it out. What is this key work here? So that's just a shortcut. Yes. I know I've got a fire extinguisher, so maybe I have to put out the fire. Oh, 
I'll just never get over how scared I used to be of this game as a kid. Now it's. Now I'm not even scared at all. So I wonder if I have to duplicate that thing and then it won't be metal anymore. I don't know. I just want to laugh everyone. Now how hard these games can be with bullets. Come on man. Reach those arms out. Quite easy to die for. Okay. When you've been on fire for so long when it's raining. Some good fire there. to suck your blood oh come on stay down come on use a fire swing so you have to come here Pro gamer, figure that out. <laughs> oh no, I came from here earlier, sorry. The first time we walked up there, it took so long. I guess she was scared. My heart was pounding. Bet you'll be the old zombies soon. Yeah. To this door. Right. <laughs> He's just chilling in cubes. Can't kill this poor dog, Shane. Oh, that's the door that's the old shed. Here's your knife. <laughs> Worth a try. I don't like this thing is. <laughs> Blow up. <sighs> Please leave your materials behind. Deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. How's about no?
that's it. I mean, that just looks like some flat disc. Oh, it is. Alloy. I thought that was for some reason another virus. Product description. Thank you for your continued support and for using our products. This time we have gathered our most advanced technologies and have succeeded in creating the unique anti-metal detection alloy. Cannot be detected by any metal detectors. Cannot be pictured by... Okay, I can't say the word. <laughs> At the immigration check, lightweight yet durable. We plan to develop various weapons utilizing this innovative new alloy. We have enclosed a sample for you to review. We look forward to hearing from you regarding possible business opportunities. Metal Industries Co. Chief Development Planning, Cole Redhill. Guess I'm gonna have to turn that emblem into that. And those cars are gonna break through that window. Material you wish to have scanned on the scanner portion of this machine. Maybe not. Get my health potion out of here. It's not really a potion, but I've played a lot of games like that. Save it. I was not good at it. I don't really know this game. I don't know if you died, you have to start all the way by the top rider, maybe. Jump to the window. Oh, 
on. Give me back my weapons. Wonderful, need that fire extinguisher again. It says empty a bit. Take the chance. To be honest, I forgot. Push it, could not push it. We have five things which is empty, isn't it? I mean, surely you have to push this bomb earlier. I mean, I'll do that. Push it over the fire.
I'm back to that room. There's dogs. Squeaky toy. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's gonna be locked. Now I was back here yeah, actually, let's just see. Sorry, I have to see. I like to explore everything. I try to be a completion as much as possible. I know I probably have to come back here, yeah, but, but I just wanna see what's kicking about. Training facility. Stab him, stab him. Gonna be locked. I oh, know. It's easy to kill him with a knife. His knife is OP. Not if you miss her. for the other place in the prison you are lucky I'm sure that things fall back in the prison. I 
can't even throw it away. Now I got this. <laughs> but I need the bullets. Ah. I guess I'll come back for you. Here's a map. The palace. I'm in a palace. like a shield shaped other Ah oh, herbs, herbs almost walked right past it. No <laughs> Yes, yes. Save room here. Bats. Oh no. These bats mean business. Went from zombies to twilight. Man, it's so hard to kill them. That was not an ashram. of headless neck. I just love this old school Resident Evil music as well. Oh, it's so nice. Yes. But I would have been happier if there was some health herbs. Secretary's notes. Four years have passed since I began serving Sir Alfred. He doesn't trust anyone. Even though I am his attendant, I am still strictly prohibited from entering his private house. What is his problem anyway? They say he lives with his twin sister Alexia in his private house on the hill. Occasionally I have seen someone standing by the window of the house. It might have been Alexia, whose extreme beauty is often talked about. I once asked Sir Alfred about this but it only enraged him. Even though I am his attendant, he will not show me any lenience. If I ask about her again, I could put my life at risk. Yo, this guy's crazy. 
After all, it is a mystery why he so desperately tries to keep his private life with Alexia a secret, Robert Dawson. Because he's into incest. <laughs> Doesn't want anyone to have his sister but him. A storage box. Yes. I'm so happy. Put this in there. I don't know when I'll get a bow gun. Navy proof, I'm not sure. Bullets. Take some more bullets here. I mean, ink ribbon, sorry. <laughs> and let's save it up. Okay guys, I think I'm just going to end my let's play there and I'll catch you on the next playthrough. Thank you.